Assalamu alaikum, I'm Shawaib and this is Muslimic News, the news and headlines you may have missed in two minutes. Which European city had no mosque for over 200 years? That's right, Athens. Greece broke that streak in November by opening up a mosque and this gave hope to Greek Muslims that they would be able to see more mosques open up. However, applications for a mosque in the city of Thessaloniki were rejected. I hope we're not waiting another 200 years for another mosque. What should we name these bins? Willie then Wasim? Great idea. Canadian-based furniture chain Structube came under heavy fire on social media after naming a pair of bins Walid and Wasim. Since then, Structube has apologized and has changed the names. Sorry, Walid. Ch, mosque, agog. The house of one will be built in Berlin, Germany, and will be costing about 47 million euros. Inside will be a church, a mosque, and a synagogue. It aims to bring the three Abrahamic faiths under one roof as an act of unity and peace. The Canadian Parliament voted to recognise the treatment of Uyghur Muslims as genocide. The motion passed with 226 to none and President Trudeau abstained. However, no direct action has been taken to sanction the Chinese government. We ask Allah to relieve our brothers and sisters from the hardships that they are facing. Special delivery! Australia Post reveals their new Frontline Heroes postage stamps which features a hijab-wearing doctor. The collection pays tribute to key workers like the police, teachers and supermarket staff. A huge well done to our Australian Muslims, keep up the good work. Last year, the New Zealand police revealed a new addition to their uniform, a hijab. Leicester police have now adopted it as part of a testing phase. The hijab has been designed with sports fabric and magnetic fasteners for both comfort and safety. Jazakallah khair for watching and I'm interested to know what you guys thought of the news so please leave your comments down below and don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell icon to be at the front of the queue for all of our future videos.